we are gonna make a walnut and carrot cake. So first of all, let's start. I have a 200, is it 200? Yeah, 260 uh, grams of all-purpose flour. I will put it in pounds in um, here, <laughs> here. Um, I have 200 and, uh, two, 220 grams of white sugar. I put a heart in it. Isn't it cute? I have what, what else? I have 300 grams of carrots that are like shredded with a, with this. Then I have the walnuts. It's, I don't remember, I, oh yeah, it's like 100 grams of walnuts. And actually what I'm gonna do with that is, um, I'm gonna cut them like in half. Like, do you see the walnut? Like just cut them in half. I will do that now with you. And I will, um, how do you call this? Oh, cinnamon. Two tablespoons of, of cinnamon. I, will, I need to like reread that. I think two tablespoons. Vanilla extract and uh, baking powder also to make it bigger. I guess, I don't really know. Yeah, I think the only purpose of Baking powder is just to make the, the to make the cake bigger, and a vegetable oil. How many? It's like two hundred and ninety-five milligrams of. I love the sound of um, vegetable oil, and I will I will do it in like a. Um, Thing like that I can take it off easily so first things first first things first out each na, 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 na. and then when the when the cake is done I will melt chocolate and put it over but that's a, that's an option because it's normally you put like frosting like the white frosting you know what I mean because it maybe tastes better but I prefer chocolate, so I will put chocolate on top of the cake. Okay, first thing, preheating the oven. Then, let's start cooking. Oh, and then, washing your hands, of course, because, no, we don't need those nasty bacterias on the food. So, yeah. I forgot one thing. We need eggs, of course. Four eggs, okay? Don't forget about that. So four eggs we need. I forgot to take them out. So four eggs, okay? Do not forget the eggs. <laughs> I almost forgot the eggs. Girl, what are you doing? I was like, hold on. I was like looking at here and I was like, something is missing, but I don't know what it is. And then when I started like looking at the recipe on my phone because I'm actually filming with my phone, I was like, oh, the eggs! So yeah, don't forget about them. Really important. All the ingredients together we will put um, the butter and then the flour so that it will not stick with clean hands of course so a spoon of butter like that and then put it in your hands and now oh my god now put it in the mold with your hands Thank you. 
Not a lot. Black flower just a little bit. So yeah. Oh, but this moves like the bottom part moves, so I need to be careful. So I'm like, how should I do it? <laughs> now I'm afraid. Not afraid, but like, how should I? holding this part and but it's it's working so <laughs> but look look at it perfect right yeah per perfect the shape is so beautiful but like no it's really kind of yeah that's it but now clean this up. Hell yeah. So I cleaned the baking space. Now let's start with the sugar and with the eggs. Um, first, you need to put the sugar. Good. Then you put the four eggs. Pull it. Just the eggs. to like cut them in half oh this is not a good cut like cut them in half and put them inside so let's just cut them in half with the hands we move so fast was moving south my secret sauce move in and out miss how you gloss that pretty mouth when you toss it back love it when you talk back Girl, you give me now i have the all-purpose flour and we need to have a tablespoon of everything except the vanilla extract we need to have no a teaspoon of everything and a tablespoon of vanilla extract Let's start with cinnamon. Oh, 
all out. And now put everything like slowly. Maybe like half of it and then you mix it and then the other half. So I'm done. It looks great. I don't believe that the vegetable oil is like the last step because it was really difficult to mix everything together. But it looks like that. It looks pretty decent. Now I'm gonna put it on the picky pan. I want to I'm gonna try to put it with one hand I know it's difficult but I will try it open the oven and put it with one hand can you do it Karina I think so perfect So yeah, we see us. Let me try it actually. I didn't try it with y'all. That is so awkward. Oh my God, it's so good. It's not like very sugary, which I love, but yeah. just make sure to say that I open the oven and let it cool like for 40 minutes so now I will take it out let's take it off I can't take it with my bare hands so you can tell that it's cool it's, it's cool and yeah so this this cake pan is easy to get out so let's just Ooh. oh this is like actually the um... wait hold on what am i doing <laughs> hold on how can i do it well how can i do it no but with the other hand it'll be the same thing <laughs> is it yeah <laughs> we need to think a little bit girl but yeah, oh my god! So I can put it like that. It smells so good. Oh my god! And now how can I take the the the, the hold on? Oh yeah, now it's gonna be this this form. <laughs> Are you excited? Oh no. Oh, it's gonna yeah. Sorry, I'm an overreacting girl, but it looks so good. Call me chef. Call me chef.
Karina. This beauty is finished. Let's start and do the chocolate. So I will not make it in bain marie. I will just like melt it slowly in the pan. But this like heats really fast, so I need to be careful. Cut this. It looks like that. So. this chocolate. Let's try this chocolate. I want you to try. I'm like, okay, so let's do it. Are you ready? I am not. But let's 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 go. but a beautiful girl. So yeah, let's try. See, the, the walnut is there. Oh my, God. my mouth, my mouth is watering. So let's try it. I wish you could try it, but I'm sorry. You can try it at home. So make the carrot and walnut cake and let me know how it went. It is so delicious. It really tastes amazing. Try this at home and let me know. And until then, we see us on the next vlog video. Yeah, thank you for watching. And until then, I say, I say bye with this delicious. Thank you for watching.